Hey everybody, welcome to Thirsty Thursday. Mark Viertaler here, up in the test kitchen here at Boot Hill Distillery. Today we're gonna to show you how to make the Nostrum. Uh, for those of you curious, Nostrum is just another word for cure-all. Uh, this is actually gonna feature our prickly ash bitters, uh, some fresh coffee, usually cold brewed. You wanna make sure this is about as chilled as you can get it. Uh, this is actually an AeroPress, the Sumatra blend uh, that we stuck in the fridge, let it cool down so it's nice and chilly. Uh, then we have Surprisingly enough, top it off with some tonic water and garnish it with a lime wedge. I know it sounds a little odd, but it's gonna be a low alcohol drink, super simple to make. It's gonna get this really nice brightness, but still some of the complexity of the coffee and of course the complexity of the bitters. So this is a really good brunch drink or even like a late evening after dinner drink. So let's get started. Here we have everything to make the Nostrum. We of course have the Boot Hill Distillery Prickly Ash Bitters. Uh, we're gonna have uh, tonic water, and we're gonna have a nice, you're really gonna want a nice, dark, uh, really just hefty coffee for this. You're gonna want it to be able to stand up to the Amaro, and also you really wanna underline the heaviness of that with the brightness of the tonic. So this is actually pretty simple to make. You're gonna go ahead and you're gonna start out. You're going to do an ounce and a half of the prickly ash. This right here, this is uh, eight ounces of the coffee. Uh, this you're gonna wanna prepare ahead of time. Again, you're gonna wanna stick this in the fridge, make sure it's it nice and cold. Uh, you're not going to wanna add ice to this drink. Uh, if you add ice, you're just really gonna water everything down, especially with the addition of tonic water, you're gonna lose a lot of that complexity. So you're just gonna go ahead and pour your cold coffee into your mug. Give that just a couple of stirs, obviously get it a little well blended. Now you're actually gonna take your tonic water just pour it into your mug. What's gonna happen is that fizziness, if you notice there, is gonna give it almost like that nice crema. And grab your lime, stick it on the rim, and there you go. There is the nostril.